What is poppin' everybody? This is Count VR here, back with another guest upload on Doc's channel. Uh, with another NU uh, SPL game, actually. It's between Meeps, or CB Jose Altove, I think it is, and Tsukushuku. Uh Meeps is with the Tyrants, and Tsuku is with the Raiders, I'm pretty sure. Um, Doc usually has it at the end of the video, too, so you'll be able to see it then. So, yeah, let's just jump into the game and let's analyze the teams. So, we brought Pissimian, which is really not well. Uh, not not used a lot in any at all, so that's interesting. Uh, they both brought some bulky offense, so uh, <laughs> something I'm familiar with at least. Golbat, which is used a lot more now because Venusaur is used a lot. Um, a lot of Executor is actually not that common at all, so I'm really curious to see what it's co what it's going to do because it can destroy Sukashugo, right? With a uh, Flamethrower, Energy Ball, and maybe like a Draco for the um, for the Incineroar. He leads with the Venusaur as Meeps leads with the... I'm gonna call him Meeps the entire time, by the way. Leads with the Hariyama. He could just fake out here to get some chip off, exactly. Now he can see if it's defensive Venusaur or not. It doesn't seem to be. It could be Life Orb, Specs, even Scarf or uh, Z-Move. As he decides to knock him off, and it is indeed Choice Specs. And that did nothing, so it's 100% AV Hariyama. Um, did not go into goal, but which is kind of interesting to me. I guess he doesn't need this that much, but he kind of needs it for the realm. He could have a pursuit hound him in the back though, so that could be the reason he did that. Um, he also needs the goal, but I guess for the uh, Pissimian, because even if it knocks him off, he checks it. But so does uh, so does Palisand. I think uh, Meep's defensive core matches up extremely well versus Zukashiku's offense. Well, it's not offense, but like what little offense he has. Um, I'm thinking this could very well be uh, AV Incineroar because he does not like to take on the likes of Houndoom for example. Houndoom destroyed the rest of his team. So I'm curious what kind of Incineroar it's going to be. It's not Z Venusaur, I doubt it's going to be Z this. Um, it, usually it's uh, Colbert uh, Rotom nowadays with Defog, Hex, will o -Wisp, and uh, Volt Switch. Um, his his Slowbro could definitely still be a Z move that also takes on a knockoff uses a lot better. Uh, because it, you usually don't want your Cinemore getting knocked off. So what they're gonna do here is uh, Zukushuku could stay in, but then he will probably lose his Venusaur to maybe like close combat to Bullet Punch. I would just knock off again here if I was Neeps, because either you hit something and you see what item they had, or uh, they have a Z-move and you see that, or you hit Venusaur for a good amount of damage. I see just close combats. Now another Bullet Punch should be able to knock it out. Um, so that works fine too. I guess he never expected Rodan because he knocked off. Is he gonna knock off here now? No, he does put points. That makes sense. Yeah. So Zukushiku makes a Zukushiku makes a very uh, you know daring play because he could have very easily knocked her and might have knocked out Rodan. But uh, like I said, I'm assuming it's Colber, so it would have taken it anyway. He could go for the Will of the Spear, but uh, yeah, it's, it's looking pretty tough for Zuku. Not gonna lie, it's he doesn't break through Meep's team well at all. Um, as Meep's goes hard into. Uh, the auto know which makes sense, it has regen anyway, even if it wants to full switch out, there, there is a ground type, but that doesn't want to take a Shadow Ball anyway. I doubt it was Shadow Ball, because then he might get Pursuit Trap by the Houndoom, he can't will his bit, Hex is not going to do anything if he is that set. So he full switches out, and let's see into what, like you could go into Venusaur again, but that's not going to do much to this if it doesn't Mega, and uh, he also still has, you know, the, either the Hariyama or the Golbat, and I doubt it's not off Venusaur. Um, you could go out into your fighting type you want here, the Passimian. Or Incineroar. Mm -hmm. But like I said, I'm assuming Incineroar is actually AV because it just makes sense on this team. Um, it doesn't have to be. It could be like a Sword and Z move. As he is Sword Sense. So let's see if he Z move. Now, Sword and Z move should be able to knock out Golbat. And I'm. As he is a knockoff area, not the Dark Slayer. And I'm not sure if Meeps wants uh, this Golbat to take damage. But then again, his Venusaur is at like 9%. And uh, he has to uh, he has to Palisand for Pissimian anyway, which 100% walls it. Knockoff doesn't do that much damage at all. So, he goes for the Brave Bird, should do a good amount. I don't know why he went for Toxic first, I guess he wanted residual anyway. Flare Blades take some more damage, take some Toxic damage, and Meeps can uh, go to something that's faster, which he doesn't have. Or he can fake it out with Hariyama, and fake out into Toxic, into Bullet Punch, should be able to knock out into Incineroar. Maybe just fake out into Toxic, do does the trick. But he loses absolutely nothing from clicking fake out right here. Um, whereas Yukushuka will lose his Incineroar. It's interesting that he is indeed the SD set, because I still think Houndoom destroys him. I'm assuming he's like uh, Earthquake or Drain Punch or Close Combat in order to take it on better. No, he just Bullet Punch should pick it off in 2%. But I'm assuming it's something like that to take it on, but otherwise... Like, now that it's dead, Houndoom <laughs> could destroy this team. Um, looking at the team... I'm not sure what kind of Houndoom it could be. It could be Z-Move Nasty Pod, it could be Scarf maybe even? Um... But it is his only real setup mom, besides maybe a Trick Room Executor. Um, so, 
he might very well be in that spot as he goes hard to Rotom on the Buddha Punch. Le again, Meeps didn't lose anything from Buddha Punching there. He just gets damage on Rotom. Now he's gonna knock the Rotom. I'm assuming is it Cobra? It is Cobra. They're not gonna do anything because of the burn. That's fine. Um, he really doesn't need the Hariyama much more anymore. So you could just keep taking knock here. Even if he goes Venusaur, that should die. If he goes something else, if Incineroar, he could sack it off. Anything else is gonna lose their item, which is absolutely fine by me. Let me uh, let me lower this a little bit for you. So. Um, what's he gonna Voltage into? He could go into um, into Rotom, but I don't know if it's Z move. If it's Z move, then that's a very very safe switch in. Uh, this is not toxic. It's AV 100%. So I think that will be the safest bet. But then again, pretty much everything else on uh, Meep's team beats <laughs> beats Rotom. <laughs> not gonna lie. <laughs> so uh, I'm very curious what he's gonna do here. He's taking a while to take it, to, to look at it too. Uh, he could click Sludge Bomb here because um, that could pick off the Hariyama. But then again, I think a Bullet Punch might be a roll. Burned Hariyama. And he doesn't really have a, a good Phoenix or switch in when this is gone. Because he did sack his Golbat. And you know, Ginky Drain does get some nice health back. So I'm not really sure what he, what he wants to do here. Uh, now that now that Golbat is gone and Hariyama is solo, uh, Phoenix or could be a, a bit of a threat. But you can't go hard into it right now obviously because you Volt Switch. And he's most likely gonna click knockoff. Um, he goes hard to Cinnamon to sack it off. Yeah, makes sense. You intimidated too, so you could go into Phoenix or now if you want to, um, to click Sludge Bomb and you know either do a lot of damage or something or kill off the Hariyama. Both of which are fine. If he wants to go, you know, into the Pelosan to take the Sludge Bomb, then you click Kick Drain off and you still don't lose anything. Even if he goes Executor, you just click Sludge Bomb again. So I feel like Phoenix is a decent play here. Um, he might want to go out into it later. I don't know why he goes Rotom. I'm, I'm assuming it kills with Hex. As he goes harder to, I don't know, on the Hex. Um, Rotom could just Volt Switch again though. Because I'm assuming he's not going to go hard Pelisand. And if even if he does, then Hex does a good amount. He does go for the Volt, uh, for the will -Wisp. Wish. Oh, that's bad. Because um, I don't know if Hex kills Avi Hariyama when it's burnt. But he tries to go for it. Heal Bell. Ah, okay. Now it's definitely not going to kill, and you might wish it up. Okay, so if he gets the wish back into Hariyama, then that's probably just going to be GG. So Tsukushuku can't let that happen, so he's going to have to attack here. As he still... Oh my god, he doesn't do it. Yeah, that's that's probably going to be game, to be entirely honest. I don't know why he let him wish back to Hariyama. I would have never let that happen. I would have attacked there, um, personally. I know the Venusaur is in, but you just fake this out and kill it. He's not burned anymore, and he's back to 71%. So this Hariyama is just completely back in it. Well, the Venusaur is gone. The Rotom is pretty much... Is it like 50, I think? Uh, the Incineroar is gone. So Zukashuko, all, it really ha all, all he has done so far is get rid of the Golbat. Which... It, it took on Venusaur, but so does Hariyama. Especially at this amount of health. And the Venusaur is at 7%. So... Um, He's not really coming back that easily. He doesn't have healing wish or whatever. As he knocks off on the road, which makes sense because knockoff was a no drawback play. Goes harder to slow, bro. I think Meeps has to switch here because if it's Calm Mind, it's a Soul Fest. Interesting as hell. Um, it's like running a Fist Death Slow King. <laughs> Anyways, this could definitely be Ice Beam. I'm assuming it has Ice Beam to uh, hit Altaria as well as, I guess, uh, Alone Executor. Energy Ball is not going to kill this. Z Energy Ball, I don't, I don't, I don't know my calcs out of, the, out of the top of my head. AV slow bro, it could just be max HP, max defense with AV. I'm not sure what set he would run. Um, and I also don't think it would be Z Energy Ball, it would probably be Z Draco. So let's see what Meeps wants to do here. He still has, you know, two Shadow Ball users, but if it's Assault Vest, then that's not going to do too much. Um, then again, maybe he should have. Uh, now he can knock it off with Hariyama later, and then the slow bro loses its uh, Assault Vest, and uh, both Hariyama and. Oh, sorry, both Houndoom and Palisand are going to do a shit ton with Shadow Ball. So now that he knows that, that's really good for him. And he can just click sh knock off next time. Especially because Phoenix are still at 8%. So he checks it with some other mods. Uh, <laughs> and we know it was spec, so it can't set up anymore. Uh, does he not have a Z-move user? Or is, uh, I, I don't believe Pissimian is a Z-move user. I don't believe Steelix is a Z-move user. So I'm assuming no. That's fair. That's fair. Um, so if I were Shikashuka here, I would probably take Ice Beam. And Meeps, I'm not sure what Meeps should do here. Meeps could go out into his... Uh, hmm. He could go out into his Audino, I guess. He could say in to sack this off and then go Hariyama and click knockoff. Uh, we know that Dark Pulse won't kill, or Shadow Ball won't kill, it, it doesn't. He goes for the Z-move, see Draco? Yeah, it's not gonna kill, but it's gonna do a good amount. Ice Beam's gonna kill it off. Yeah, that makes sense, makes sense. 
He did weaken this Lobo to a good amount. He could even go to Hariyama here and click knockoff. I don't know if it kills at this point, but at least you put it in range of anything from Haunum, and Haunum could sweep Haunum and Pelasan and just take on the rest of his team, basically. So let's see what it has to do here. He could also go to Haunum. I don't know if Haunum kills at this range with Dark Pulse, uh, because it is a Solve Vest Lobo, but it's still a super effective stab. I uh, also don't know if it's Life Orb or Scarf. If it is Life Orb, then I kind of think it does kill, to be entirely honest. Um, <laughs> but Shadow Ball from Pelasan is definitely not going to kill. So let's see what Meeps goes out into. I still think Hariyama is a fine play too to click knockoff. Yeah. Um, you could fake out first, but if he switches, then you don't gain anything. Do you? Uh, you don't lose anything either. You don't really lose anything either, but I still think that knock knocking off immediately is fine. Okay. I see close comments predicting the switch. Wow. That was that was a ballsy play. I love that. Goes hard Pelasan because Pelasan walls this. He clicks u turn which makes sense because Pelasan is always coming in. Phoenixer comes out and he can, can just click Giga Drain again. Um, he could go to Houndoom or Hariyama. He does click Giga Drain. Does 34. Good God. Then again, no Dark Pool switch ins. So, uh, especially because Passimian took how much? 64%. As he pursue traps the Venusaur. Very well played. Venusaur gone. Not much of a threat anymore. And I, I don't see how he's going to kill Passimian at this point. Passimian outspeeds the Slowbro. Has super effective stab. Uh, it is a Salt Fest, so it might take one Shadow Ball. It probably does. It has the Earth Power for Steelix, potentially. It's usually. Um, Toxic, Shore Up, Stealth Rocks though, so probably doesn't, but you never know. Um, he goes harder to Hariyama on the Steelix, gets Toxic. Thank God he didn't go into Pasimian, uh, sorry, Palisand. And he can just click Close Combat again because if he gives, uh, if he goes, exactly, if he goes uh, Slowbro after, you can just knock it off. So I'm assuming he's gonna kill him with Heavy Slam. That did nothing. I forgot that Hariyama is thick as fuck. So once again, I think you lose nothing from Close Combating. Oh, as he actually reveals Protect. So right now I would knock off. Even if you knock off the Steelix, that's fine. If he wants to go to Slowbro on the knockoff, that's fine too. Um, but knocking off the Steelix means it's not getting any health, especially with Protect. Uh, Toxic Protect Steelix is... Uh, it's, it's a pretty good set. I like it, but uh, I haven't seen it in a while. Heavy Snap Toxic Protect Stealth Rocks. Hmm. The reason I don't like it too much is because it doesn't do anything to Clink uh, Clank. I think this team kind of just loses to Clink Clank. <laughs> Looking at it. I, I mean, Slowbro takes a hit, but not that well. It is a Salt Fest, so it might very well have a Flamethrower slash Fire Blast. Um, and he also had the Rotom, which obviously takes most hits. So, um, he is going to switch into Passimian on the knock. No, close combat. Wow. Okay. That's fair. Passimian dead. And um, I I don't really see Houndoom losing much more. He goes into Houndoom. Yeah, I mean, uh, if this... Oh, Jesus. Okay. I was going to say, if this lives a Dark Pulse, which I'm assuming it does, then it's gone. But yeah, now he just goes out into his Pedal and clicks either Earth Power if he has it or Shadow Ball. And it does carry Earth Power. That's a GG. And I think Meeps was in control the whole time. I don't think he ever lost. Uh, the fact that it's Destiny Bond Houndum actually tells me that it's most likely Scarf. Pursuit Destiny Bond is most likely the Scarf set with uh, Dark Pulse Fire Blast usually. So, uh, that's fair. Palasan literally ki came out twice and did all it had to. So, this is apparently the standing between Tyrants and Raiders. Uh, Meeps or CB Jose Altave, whatever one. I don't even know what week this is, but I know that. It's a, it's a semi-finals. Oh, this is actually this is actually up to date. Wow, holy shit. So, yeah. The, it's actually 3-2 at the moment of this recording, which is pretty hype. So, that's going to be it for the game. I'm assuming Doc is going to go back to the game too. Please, Doc? No? Okay, that's fine. Then I'm, I'm, that's the end of the video then. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like. Goodbye. <laughs>